good morning. I'm vlogging my weekend. It is Friday morning. I still have tan last night and I'm wondering if I should shower yet because I have a pure bar class at 12 and I'm wondering should I shower, do the class, shower again or wait, work out and then shower. Probably the second option but I don't know because self tan is so weird. Okay, I decided that I'm going to just shower after because I don't want to shower twice. I think that's a good idea, but this is my ice roller I use every morning Skinny Confidential. It's really amazing, and it just gets rid of deep puffing. And I'm going to make some breakfast and take my vitamins before going over to a workout class. First, since I always take Woman's Multi, two of these. The vitamin D to get that vitamin D in. Three of my Nature's Plus GI Total Wellness. It's like my probiotic. But then we got the JS Health Hair and Energy Vitamins. And I've been taking this green tea extract every now and again. My dad takes it and I literally found it in his vitamin drawer and I was curious just because um, it gives you like energy and a healthy metabolism. So I've just been starting to test the waters with it and see how I feel. Sometimes I like overthink it when I'm taking my pills and I like hold them in my mouth until I'm ready to swallow them. Now I'm gonna make breakfast. This is my breakfast that I make every single morning. It's my hyperfixation. It's avocado toast on gluten-free bread with two eggs over easy. And I season my avocado very specifically, which I'll get into once it's ready. Always, always, always get pasture raised eggs. Seriously. This is the gluten free bread I use. It's the Canyon Bakehouse brand. This is the ancient grain one. There's like a ton of different kinds. This one I don't really prefer because the bread is literally so small. There's another one I normally get. It's called like the seven grain one from the same brand and it's like bigger, like the size of sourdough. So right now I've been doing a bread and a half, which is just like why, but. The next very important step of my routine is my coffee. So this is my favorite coffee cup that I have, but I normally use the Starbucks medium roast iced coffee. I also really like the stock brand. That's a good one too. I fill it up to the brim, literally. And then I love the Clefia Farms almond milk creamer and French vanilla. So good. My mom and I have been obsessed with this. And I just do a little bit of that and mix it all up. All right, now it's time to put the avocado on my toast. I have this perfect avocado and I'm just gonna use half today for my toast. So first I'm putting the avocado on my literal toast and a half and any extra avocado I have, I just put on the side because I'm a huge avocado person. First thing is Trader Joe's Everything Bagel Seasoning. It doesn't have to be Trader Joe's, but I find that it's like so good whenever I get it from there. Then I put a little bit of traditional yeast, which is kind of like a dairy-free cheese alternative. Lately, I've been liking to put a little garlic salt as well. Normally, I put red pepper flakes too, but I don't have them at the moment at the Airbnb we're staying at. We're in between houses right now, so we're literally at an Airbnb. So then I use this Sriracha Fix brand. It's so good, I love it. I feel like no one really like ever talks about this brand, but it's delicious. Then I take my two eggs and put them on my toast and then one kind of like on the side. Then the best part, I take this trough oil and I put it on my toast and eggs. And then sometimes when I'm feeling extra crazy, I take the trough hot sauce as well and douse that a little bit on my toast. And it's just like this little concoction, but it is so good. Okay, I'm in the car. I'm about to head over to Pure Bar. I have my workout outfit on and my Pilates socks. Let's go. Okay, I'm here. So I'll talk to y'all soon. Bye. 
Hello, I just got done with Pure Bar and I headed over to Dick's. I'm gonna go inside and see if they have the New Balance running shoes I'm looking for. I'm deciding if I wanna get New Balance running shoes or Hoka's. So I'm going into Dick's right now to see if they have the New Balance shoes so I can try them on because I tried on the Hoka's yesterday but I don't wanna buy the Hoka's until I try the New Balances. So we're gonna go do that. But I'm at Dick's. I'll keep you guys posted. Guys, that was so quick. I was in and out because I went over to like the Hoka's and New Balances, which are the two that I've been looking at. And I found a pair of Nikes and they're so cool. I've never seen them before. They have like a silver lining on the back. I'll show you guys when I get home because I don't want to like take it out of the box right now and make a mess in my car, but I'm so excited. And they feel the same as the New Balance and Hoka's. So yay. I needed a new pair of shoes because I hadn't gotten a new pair literally since probably like eighth grade or freshman year of high school, which is so, so bad for your feet like I told my friend and she was like that is so bad for your feet and your knees and everything and I'm like yeah and then I was at the gym the other day and one of the grippies fell off the bottom of my shoe and I was like okay it's time to do this these are my new shoes so cute with the silver that's what got me because they're just so different looking it's really nice mom approves <laughs> this is them on I love them So they have a, a house made keto bread. Cheers. <laughs> okay, I look crazy because we just got back from our walk. We walked all over town last minute. But I got this super cute gift from a boutique downtown for my friend Julia. I'm going to her birthday dinner tonight. And we also picked up our pottery. I painted pottery last week. And so I finally picked it up, but it's wrapped up because it's a gift for my parents. So I'll show you guys once they open it. But now I'm gonna shower finally and start getting ready for the night. Okay, I just showered and I'm about to nice in my hair. I've got the setup here, do my makeup, and then head over to Julia's. Quick little update, I just finished blow drying my hair. I'm deciding if I want to curl it with the air wrap or just curl it with my dry bar curler. I'm not really sure what the vibes are yet. I might do my makeup and then decide. I'm filming a get ready with me on TikTok. I'm also starting back up my YouTube channel from high school this weekend and I'm so excited. So I'm literally vlogging this right now. <laughs> just finished dicing my hair and I've done my makeup besides my lips. All right, I'm all ready. I'm wearing this oversized sweater with black shorts under and these boots. I'll go in like a full size mirror and show you guys. This is the fit. It's kind of dark in here. All right, now you can see it better. This is the fit. Woo, at first I was like questionable about this outfit, but now I think it's kind of fun. I just gotta be careful in these boots because they are quite high. around there to meet up with more friends and it was just so fun and I love celebrating Julia. Happy Saturday. Let's have a day. Good morning world. I'm about to make breakfast. Ice rolling is a must this morning. My face is quite puffy and I just showered and I feel so much better after showering. I just feel more clean. I'm gonna make avocado toast and then I think I'm gonna go for a walk and get some steps in. I'm just craving a nice walk outside. I will see where my Saturday takes us. I think I might be going to dinner tonight with my parents and Michael. We'll see because also my friend wanted to do something so I don't know like which option we'll go with. But I'm gonna cover up the number on here but I wanted to show you guys. I made this pottery plate and I made this because we're moving to a new house so I did like a little housewarming gift for my parents and 
it went through the kiln and we picked it up yesterday and it turned out so cute like <laughs> it's just hilarious because this idea was like so last minute my parents liked it that's all that matters um Okay, being completely transparent, I've just chilled in my rope for the past couple hours on my phone because I needed it. I'm just going to have a snack and then I think I'm going to go for a walk because it's starting to get sunny out. It was raining, but the sun's coming out and I think it will benefit me to go outside. So I'm going to do that. This is my outfit. It's recess pickleball, Montauk, New York. So cute. And then matching green olive tennis skirt from recess pickleball brand also they sent me this so cute i have my headphones to match and my new sneakers i'm gonna go walk and get some movement All right, time to get ready. I have my beverage, my water. I'm gonna do my makeup first and then manage whatever this hair is I have going on. Okay guys, I'm all ready for dinner. I'm wearing this bodysuit paired with leather pants and little baby kitten heels. I love these kitten heels, they're so cute. They have like a belt type thing, I don't even know. Yeah, that's the outfit. I put my Patrick Ta glow bomb on my chest, of course, to glow a little bit. Here's my makeup. I had to like re-dice in my hair because it was so gross from last night. But yeah, I'm so excited for dinner. Happy Sunday. I'm clearly having a lazy Sunday. I've just been chilling. I talked on the phone with some of my friends and hanging out. And yeah, I'm gonna have a little go macro bar snack. And then I might go for a walk outside. It's colder today, so it's hard to get myself out there, but I think it'll be good for me. Either that or go to the gym, but the gym just doesn't sound appealing today. So I think I'm just gonna go for a walk outside and do the whole gym thing like during the week. Hello? I got this thing. It's a candle warmer. A candle warmer? Yeah, so it's like a lamp type thing and you put it like your candle under it and you just put the lamp over the candle and then it makes your room smell like the candle without having to light it. Oh, wow. It's really cute looking. See, look how cute. Wow. Oh, yeah. That's adorable. It's cute. Whoa, it's warm for sure. You can put a timer on it too, like two hours, four hours, eight hours. Okay, I'm about to head out for a little walk. Finally getting dressed for the day. It's a little cold, so I layered up and just put this crew neck over. Don't mind all my dirty laundry, literally. But here we go. I've been in a walking mood lately, I guess. But let's do it. Okay, I just showered and I'm already in my pajamas at like 7 p.m. But I'm wearing the Jerf Avenue Sophia Richie pajamas and they're literally so amazing. They're kind of Christmassy because they came out during Christmas, but I love them. They're so comfy and airy. And I'm about to help my mom make dinner and have some dinner. We're doing salmon, Brussels sprouts, and rice, I think. I'm also going to wash my sheets because I just like to do that sometimes on Sundays, especially after a long weekend. Yum.
I am. <laughs> that looks good. What do you season it with? Lemon pepper seasoning and salt. Yum. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> but then he looks so innocent. Yeah, that's why we, that's why we keep them. Hard because they have the bed bug protectors on them too. Yeah. Clean sheets on Sunday. And so you're gonna you see how you have the buttons up here. Mm -hmm. so opposite. And it's inside out? Mm-hmm. Let me show you. So you're just gonna take the hat and then just tie the there's like a little thing that sticks here, just tie this right around it. And just do like a regular knot. Wait, this here? Yep. Tie it around what? See this, there's a string. So see, on here, there should be a little thing right there. Oh. And just, you can do like two knots. Okay. Okay, and go up to here, this one, do the same thing. Okay, now stick your hand in. See right here? So stick your hand in. Yep. And then go all the way down and grab the corner. So grab the corner where the comforter is. Mm -hmm. And pull it through? Yeah. Shake it. Shake it up. <laughs> See, and then just tuck that in. Yeah. And then just button. That makes it a lot easier than having to like shove it through there and figure it all out. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you just fluff her out a little bit. Nice and fresh. Yep, here. here you go. <gasps> Yay. Fresh looks clean excited. sheets. Thank you. You're welcome. Hello, everybody. It's nighttime now, and I'm about to go to bed. I think I'm gonna end the vlog here, but thank you so, so much if you made it this far to watch this vlog because it means a lot to me. This was my first vlog back on YouTube in years, probably three years, if not more. And I used to love it so much and I stopped when I was in college. And just like filming and vlogging this weekend made me remember and realize how much I truly do love making YouTube videos. And so I'm so happy to be back in a place to be able to do that. Them. and thank you so much for supporting and watching if you are but i hope everybody has a lovely week and yeah i'll see you in the next vlog bye